Imagine you had a super smart assistant right by your side with your favorite apps like Word, Excel, PowerPoint and many more. So you have to look for only one tool that is Microsoft Copilot. Let's say you are rushing to finish a big project and need a presentation or a detailed report of it. Just tell Copilot what you need like summarize these notes into a project plan or create a chart with last quarter sales and it does the work for you. Drafting text, pulling in data, designing slides, it's like Tony Stark Jarvis at your side, making your work life faster, easier and a whole lot cooler. In short, Microsoft Copilot is an AI assistant in Microsoft 365 that helps tasks like writing, analyzing data, organizing information, making work faster and easier. Hey everyone, welcome back to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Today I've got some exciting news to share. I know so many of you have been saying, I can't seem to get Microsoft Copilot running on my Windows 11. Well, guess what? Today we are tackling that together. Let's dive in and unlock the magic of Copilot on Windows 11. Are you ready? Let's do this. Just a quick info guys, Simply Learn has got generative AI courses. You can unlock the future of AI with the top rated Gen AI courses. You can elevate your creative capabilities with our highly acclaimed generative AI courses. Dive into AI-driven innovation, explore key concepts like generative AI, prompt engineering, chat GPT, Microsoft Copilot, and many more. With this course, you are going to acquire a cutting edge knowledge to gain competitive edge and advance your career in the evolving AI landscape. So guys, hurry up now and join the course. The course link is mentioned in the description box. So guys, let's start with installing Microsoft Copilot on Windows 11. Now, in order to install Microsoft Copilot, you need to follow these steps. The first one is you need to ensure that your system is up to date. So what you can do all over here, go to settings, okay? And you will see all over here, when you go to home, you will see Windows update is option will be there. So just click on check for updates. So you can see it's checking for updates and install any available updates present. Now enable the copilot in the taskbar. So what you can do, go to the personalization. Okay. And uh, after that, go to the taskbar. So you can see here you will be having the taskbar. And here you can locate the copilot option and toggle it on. Okay, so that's one very simple. Or uh, what you can do all over here, the next thing you can go to the Microsoft Store app. So you can see all over here, there's a Microsoft Store. And uh, what you can search all over here, copilot. Okay, let me search. So you can see Microsoft Copilot is there. So if you have the proper subscription of Microsoft 365, then it will be very easy for you to get it. So all you require is Microsoft ID and password. And with that, it's going to be very easy. Now you can access the copilot. So after installing it, so let us install the copilot. So let us click on get. Okay, I still don't have. So it's installing copilot. So you can see all over here that uh, it is directing me to the Microsoft workspace. Now, if I'll open all over here, you'll easily see that my Microsoft Copilot is installed. So this was one of the step of installing Microsoft Copilot. If you don't see the Copilot option in your taskbar settings, it might be due to regional availability or system compatibility. So ensure your Windows 11's version supports Copilot that all updates are installed. For more detailed guidance, what you can do, you can refer to the Microsoft official support page. And there's a one note that Copilot availability may vary based on your region and system specification. Now, let us install Microsoft Copilot through Vibe Tool. So, what is Vibe Tool basically? So, guys, Vibe Tool. So, guys, what is Vibe Tool? Vibe Tool is an open source command line utility for Windows that allows users to enable or disable hidden experimental features in Windows operating system. Primarily used in Windows 10 and Windows 11. It was developed by the book is closed. So you can see this is the organization which developed the Vive tool or a team which developed the Vive tool. And all over here, Vive tool provides user access to features and configurations that are often in testing or not yet released by Microsoft. 
So the key features of this tool are you can access the experimental features. So Vibe tool can unlock features that Microsoft is testing internally, letting users experience and provide feedback on new functionality before it's widely available. Then you get Find Control. This tool enables specific feature IDs associated with different system capabilities, which allows users to enable or disable them individually or in group. And this is primarily for insiders. Many features accessible via Vive tool are only available in Windows Insider builds, where the major idea is Microsoft experiment with new idea or new functionality of operating system. Now, how to download Vive tool? So you can go to this link https github.com the book is closed slash five slash releases okay so you will be directed to this page now all over here you can go in assets okay and you can see vibe tool zip so click on it and you can see the vibe tool is going to get downloaded now extract this vibe tool so open this page okay i'll go in my downloads and i'll click on extract all now you can see all over here we have downloaded our Vibe tool. So what you can do all over here, copy as path, okay. Open the terminal in administrator mode. Okay guys, so you can see all over here, I have opened my terminal in the administrator mode. Now, what is the next thing I'm going to do? Next thing, I'm going to open the same thing. So just type CD and the path you have pasted, just control V. Now you can see all over here, the path that we have copied of our wipe tool, we have got into that folder. Now, the next thing what we have to do all over here, so you can see there's a Microsoft community all over here. And uh, here, it helps us in the installing. Now, after this, you can see the link is given all over here. So, so I'll mention this link in our comment box and you would be getting directed to this page. Now, you can see all over here, after we have gone into that terminal and we are into that required folder, the next thing is we have to run the following command. So, wipe tool enable, I did this. Okay, let's try to run this command. Now, you can see we have successfully set our configuration. Now, in this way, we have installed the wipe tool. Okay, so you can see all over here, we have successfully set the feature configuration and this will enable your copilot. Now, all you have to do is after that, just click on your search bar and search Copilot. You will see that it is available, this feature. So, in this way, you can enable Copilot on your Windows 11 operating system. I hope so, guys, you would have got a brief idea regarding how to install Microsoft Copilot on your Windows 11 operating system. Thank you, guys, for watching this video. Staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling. Whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career, we've got you covered. Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Designed in collaboration with leading universities and top corporations, and delivered by industry experts. Choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.